and welcome to our instructional series of videos. In this installment, we're going to show you how to install drives in the OWC MiniStack STX storage and expansion solution. There are a couple of different versions of the MiniStack STX, but these differences are largely cosmetic. So while we'll be performing this installation on the all black model, these instructions will apply to other models as well. We've already gathered our materials and are working on a soft static free surface. We're now ready to begin. The first step is to remove these four Phillips screws from the bottom of the enclosure. Flip the enclosure back over and lift the top off from back to front. There's a cable connecting the circuit board to the light on the front of the enclosure that you'll need to disconnect. Simply slide the cable out from under the hook on the bottom half of the chassis then carefully lift up on the edges of the connector until it comes free. You can then set the top of the enclosure aside. To install an M.2 module into the STX, first remove this screw. The notch in the M.2 module lines up with the pin in the drive slot. Align the two and slide the M.2 module into place at a slight angle. Then, press the module down so that it lays flat and secure it with the screw you removed earlier. To install a 3.5 inch SATA drive into the SATA bay, line the two connectors up and slide the drive into the bay so they're firmly seated. To secure the drive, you'll need the six larger Phillips screws that came with your STX. First, attach these three points on the side of the drive bay. When you have those attached, flip the chassis over and use the remaining screws on these three holes to secure the drive in place. Installing a 2.5 inch drive is very similar. Again, you'll line the two connectors up and slide the drive into the bay so that the connectors are firmly seated. To secure a 2.5 inch drive, you'll need the four smaller screws included with the STX. Using one hand to hold the drive in place, flip the chassis over and secure the drive with a screw in each of these four holes. Once you have the drives you want installed into your STX, you can now reattach the cable by carefully reseating the connector back into its socket then hooking the cable back into its clip on the chassis. You can then replace the cover Then flip the unit over and replace these four screws in the bottom. Your OWC Mini Stack STX is now ready to hook up, format, and use.